the debrief and evaluation. So after the competition's run and everything's packed up and put away, and there's you know five minutes left or whatever there is, um, usually I'll, um, I like to talk to students about you know what they sort of found out and what they'll come away from the project with. I think it's nice to sort of let them lead the conversation and you know just ask a few conversation starting questions like. If you knew someone who was about to start this project and you could only tell them one thing, what would you tell them? <clears throat> yeah, just kind of get their, their uh, idea as to what they found. You can also ask them questions like the trends. So was it the flat bridges kind of that went straight across like this one? Or did the bridges have to have like the walls and be more of a square sort of shape or what was the shapes that did the best and what didn't do so well and what joints did well and what didn't do so well and how did you use your time, how do you think your team worked together, did you in fact have any like production line set up, so some students and groups will do that, they'll have one person gluing one, like getting it ready, the next person with a glue gun, the person after, you know, doing the next bit and they'll kind of work like that. Um, you might also ask them, like, how did you make decisions? How did you see your group? Was it more of a democracy or more, more of a, a dictatorship or whatever it was? I also like to announce the winner. I think I did put this in another video. But I've made just a completely rubbish trophy. Um, I put the students' names on it. Um, and when they win and, like, what their what their score was, so there's a whole bunch of different scores here in the year, so they can have a bit of a legacy. I also give out chocolate bars, I always usually give out chocolate bars, and I'm trying to make a big deal out of it, and, you know, make them feel great about it. And I do like to hand out Kit Kats and stuff, because, you know, you break a Kit Kat and we've just spent half an hour breaking their work. Some students ask if they can take their bridges home, usually they don't have a problem with it. Um, but, I mean, that's up to you. Usually, you know, they'll all just go straight in the bin. There's not much we can do with them, unfortunately, uh, with the hot glue. Yeah, that's, that's basically it. Uh, I did have a worksheet once, but I just found that it, some students weren't doing it, and I was just getting mediocre responses. Like, I think it's better to have a conversation. Everyone's usually pretty jovial after the, um, after the competition, so sometimes we just need to calm down for a second. Um, but other than that, it's, um, yeah, it's a bit of fun and everything should be all clean and yeah, everyone's had a good time. So again, um, if you have any questions, send me an email. Um, I've got a contact link somewhere around here, so yeah, just hit that. And, um, you know, if you've got any suggestions for me, I'd love to hear them too. So yeah, send me an email with, um, with what you think. All right, fantastic.